Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. I am here to do three unboxings today. They're kind of random sprinkled into here, but they are all things I've purchased recently or maybe not so recently, and I just wanted to share it with you in case you're interested. If you wanna see what I got, stay tuned. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Emily and I love handbags. I also love travel, fashion, luxury. So if you like any or all of those things, consider subscribing and hitting the notification bell so that you'll be notified of my future videos. And just a quick plug here, if you're interested in a free handbag, I am giving one away for my 5K giveaway. It ends July 11th, so if you, you're watching this video and you wanted to win and it's not July 11th, 2023 yet, then consider going to that video to enter. I will list the information below in the description box. You can enter through YouTube or Instagram or both to increase your chances. It is my way of thanking everybody for participating commenting, supporting my channel all these years. I actually hit 5K last year. I'm about to hit 6K, so I hope we can continue to grow together and do more giveaways. Also, that way I can share more, you know, good luxury travel, food, fashion things with all of you. All right, so like I said, today is a random three unboxings. One is from a new to me brand called Lola Rose. Another one is not new to me called Dior. I'm sure you know about that one. And then finally, I have a Polen unboxing as well. I have not done a Polen unboxing for a long, 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 long time. So I'm very excited about that. And it's not what you think. So I don't even know if you can guess what the item is. It's not what I'd expect. I don't think it's what you would have expected, but Let's get started. So, um, okay, there are a few things here. I think I'm gonna do this box first. This one is from Lola Rose and it is, it comes in this box. It is extremely heavy actually for what it is. I was actually very surprised. And they also have a little like sealing label here so that you'll know if anyone's tampered with it. But otherwise, yeah, it's from Lola Rose. And again, this is a brand that's new to me. And just for full disclosure, this is something that was sent to me. I'm not getting paid to do this video, but I just wanted to let you know that um, I did not buy this item. I did buy the other two though, so for full transparency. It's very well packed. As you can see, there's this styrofoam right here. Oh, how do I even... Oh, wow. Okay, so it's like very well packed as you can see whoa yeah nothing is destroying this th this baby okay like look it's like it's put it's stay it's in here <laughs> wanted to give you a closer look this is what it looks like this box this is why it's so heavy and if i take it out this is the empty box and <laughs> this is still this is still wedged in here really well and so this is the other part of the styrofoam it's shrink wrapped in here, so you can see that even if this got wet, you are covered. Carefully. All right, wow, look at that. This is beautiful. Um, Lola Rose is a British designer. She started this up back in 2000, so it's been almost 14 years. Um, and yeah, it's it's a jewelry brand initially and she also has watches. So this is what this is about. It kind of looks like a watch box, doesn't it? So here we go. I don't know what this is. This is my first look at it too. Okay, so this bottom, I love that it pulls out into this. Wow, okay, so the, here we go. This is um, a little travel pouch and I can see something peeking out. It is a bracelet. I will, I will, I will show you that in just a sec. And there is also a um, little care card, I think, probably care booklet in here. Oh, I love the design. Look at that. Okay, so let me just close. I'll show you that later, I promise. And here we go. Look how beautiful. It says Lola Rose London, and it is very well wrapped right here. Um, this is the watch that I picked out. So, okay, let me see if I could just wiggle this out because it is, ooh. Okay, here we go. It, it comes wrapped like this, and um, it also has this really pretty cushion that is in the green color and it has these little snaps so if once you take this out you can also wow look at this you can put the straps behind so that it doesn't uncurl but look at this this is gold oh it's so luxurious this um okay so let me put this down and put on the watch 
So this is what it looks like and it has a little tag right here that says Lola Rose. In case you're interested, um, you know, there's no price tag. If you wanted to give it as a gift, it's certainly doable. So I'm gonna slide this out of this plastic wrap. And here it is. This is the Malachite watch face. It's called the Miss Lola. I have it in the rose gold. Let me see if I could unwrap this to show you. So it's very well wrapped as you can see. Wow, the Malachite is beautiful. Um, it is a rectangular face and it does have these very smooth leather straps. So I'm just gonna put this Take this off there's so much wrapping here but yeah that's why it comes pristine um so you can also kind of see on the metal there it's in etched with lola rose again and let me just put this on really quick the leather seems a little stiff right now but i'm thinking that as i wear it it will loose it will um soften so uh in the meantime, it is very beautiful, um, like in its shine. So there are two leather um, uh, loops right here so that this strap that hangs out won't fly around. So just wanted to show you. Here we go. What do we think? Very professional, very boss lady. Like, I don't know. I don't have anything like it. So I'm, I'm very excited to give this a try. Um, and so like with any watch that you get new, it does, it does come with like a little stopper right here so that the battery is not being used. So if you take that out, then you can start using it. Uh, so for, so yeah, I just need to push this button in. What time is it? So it's 3.45. I'm going to set it to 3.45. Oops went over time, push it in and we're ticking. So I think this is a very uh, good watch for the office. I think it's fairly low key and it goes with almost anything. I'm wearing like, you know, a white shirt today, but um, I could see myself wearing a black sweater or, you know, a blue cardigan. I think it will all go really well. Um, I can also see it being dressed up. Uh, this is a black strap, so you can definitely wear it. And you can kind of see this piece. It, I mean, the watch face just makes it look so jewelry-like, you know, especially with the rose gold and everything. So I, I'm loving it already, and I think it is a very beautiful piece. Um, I will link this watch below, but it also comes in different shapes. Let me get to the watch band that I was showing you earlier. So remember the watch band, um, there's an extra one down here that looks like this. This one, let's see, does it say anything? Okay, so it comes with the little screwdriver and some pins. And so what this actually looks like, oh wow, okay. So this is also all wrapped up, as you can see, it's a bracelet, um, but it's in the rose gold. All right, so just got a shipment in, another one from Lola Rose. I'm just gonna quickly show you what it is. It's an accessory piece um, that I requested, but it ships separately, so let's see. Again, really good packaging. 
got this really sturdy and thick styrofoam piece. Okay, this is what I had seen last time. So this is the box that you would get from if you were to buy a watch. And so I'm just gonna wiggle this out. This is a very sturdy box. Oh, by the way, there's more styrofoam down there, just like the other one. Okay, so now we have the box and that's what it looks like. I love these boxes. I'm glad I get another one. So here's the watch. So it looks like um, what I wanted to share with you is that this actually, okay, so let me just take this out really quick just to show you it has the same uh, green felt plush. The other one that I have was black, I believe, or the black strap. So this one's slightly different. This one is the same watch that I showed you just now, except it has this other bracelet. This is a very interesting bracelet, um, different than the chain mail one that I have. And uh, I think the adjustment on this one is also easier. So this is part, uh, this is the Miss Lola watch and it has the malachite face with the, I think this is rose gold. Yes, this is rose gold. In this light, it kind of looks gold, but it's actually rose gold. It was so. Okay, yeah. So there's a silica gel and then there is a care card right here. And this one has more information. I actually didn't show you this last time, but this one has, besides, you know, um, details of this, brand and you know warranty information care it also tells you how to um, set the time and adjust this is the strap that I showed you last time already and this is the strap that I have now and then um, it doesn't have anything telling you about how to switch out the straps but I already actually showed a video clip of me switching this out so but it's the same idea as before so you just need to wedge that one black tool um, into here and then pop this out and you can exchange it. So if you, you can actually buy this watch and then buy the other two straps and then you can have three different watch looks with just one watch. But yeah, thank you so much to Lola Rose for sending me this to review and I will share it with you, uh, the updates soon. All right, so I have it on now. Um, it is more on the loose side, but I think that's okay. I actually had to take off two of these guys. Um, because this came with it and it was too long. So this is this watch strap is actually much easier to uh, remove the chains and uh, you don't need a tool for it. Uh, if it, this is too loose for you, I already have a small wrist. So for most of you, this should be okay. But if it is too, still too loose, you have to use another tool to actually push out the pins here. So we have one of these watch band link pin tools where there are three different punches a watch band holder um so what we're gonna do is knock out one of the the little pins to the links to shorten it because i thought it still was a little loose so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna find the pin that fits the watch band um the little the pin and um and then show you how it works so in the watch there are these little arrows that show you to where where you should punch so you can kind of see that that is where you punch and the arrow goes downwards so that's what we're gonna do okay so the pin fell through and now the links can now come apart and then so there's the pin so then you have to make sure you save this so we're gonna take off another link and do the same thing and then piece the this back to together so basically you're removing a link i'll also link the video that lola rose had the, the one that they used below so that you can see this is just the way that we did it but you can certainly bring it to a watch place or if you have a different watch um, link remover you can also use that this looks like a piece of jewelry more than just a watch so it's very unique Wow, how beautiful. I am so excited to wear this out. I have a wedding to attend in the next week, so I'm going to be I'm definitely going to be wearing this, I think. It's just so pretty. Um thank you Lola Rose for sending me this set. I will definitely um review it and then share it with you guys how it wears over time. Um but like I'm just so impressed with it right now. Like just everything so far, like just seeing, you know, the the presentation, the weight of this, the just, you know, like the little 
the little drawer is so cute. Um, everything just looks so great. Uh, just for full disclosure, I am not a watch enthusiast. I know there are a lot of really, really nice watches, movements and everything out there. I don't think I'm at that level. Um, so I'm kind of looking at this from the, you know, how, how pretty and how uh, sturdy it feels, it looks, you know, and all of that. So I'm just giving you that perspective and then the long-term wear and tear. Um, but if you want to know more about the, you know, movement or the materials or the you know, the precious stones or whatever that goes into watches, I will list this item in the description box below. I also have a promo code. If you wanna save some money off of your order from Lola Rose, I will also list my promo code here or in the description box below. I know there are also a lot of other styles and a lot of other designs and colors and materials. So I will be sure to list some of my favorites here to share with you in case you're interested. The price point I think is actually very good. Um, it feels very luxurious, but it does not cost an arm and a leg. So, you know, if you wanted to get a really nice watch just to like feel good, wear it, um, you know, match some of your more prettier, fancier outfits, I would definitely look into Lola Rose. Um, yeah, so stay tuned for an updated review. Uh, I will post that maybe in a couple months time. All right, I am going to unbox this Dior item. Um, this one is very heavy uh, because my essay popped in some books. He knows that I love um, the uh, ready to wear books. And then this is also one that I think sometimes they mail it to me, but it's like a magazine from Dior. But I especially love the, um, the catwalk uh, sort of pictures just because I love seeing them. They're so pretty. So I got to flip through this one. I already peeked at some that I really, really like. So I can't wait to see what else is in there. And of course, these little stars are my favorite. I love hanging on my tree during the holidays. So I'm going to add this to the collection. All right, so there is, it's not actually very well wrapped um, because it was not my usual essay, but I, I had to go pick this up because it was, oh, it smells so good, because it was pretty much the last one that they had in stores. Um, you can still order this, I believe, online. So this one is from their newest collection, uh, and you can tell by the pinkness of it. So just get right into it. Cause I know the video is getting long. So here we go. They are the set of three candles from the most recent limited edition collection. Oh, I can smell, it smells so good. I don't know what each one of them are called. I will list them here somewhere if I could find it, but they all individually smell really nice. And I am a huge fan of Trois de Juin. So I think you can see that the Trois de Juin design is here, except it's in the pink and the gray or navy, I guess that's dark gray. But yeah, there are three different containers and they all look so beautiful. And again, I just love Trois de Juin. So this is a great little limited edition set. They don't usually come out with these colors. It's usually like, you know, the blue and you know, red, maybe green, gray, but this one is a beautiful set. So anyway, I thought I'd share that with you. I think I still saw this available online if you're interested, but it comes in this beautiful box. This collection also has like yoga mats, um, I believe a water bottle, loungewear, beach towels, all of that. So I will link this piece below if you're interested and um, some of my other favorites. So if you're interested, definitely hop on it because I think um, a lot of their ready to wear line their handbags are selling out from this special collection and if you're in kyoto i believe they also have a special um building built out for showcasing this and the beachy vibes and everything i wish i could go but yeah if you're there i would de definitely go visit but beautiful piece at least i have this in my collection and i guess i'll put it up here to make all of my things smell for the meantime still working on the um does, you know, organization. So you'll see that coming soon. Um, again, once I have it all set up, I will, I will definitely share it with you. But in the meantime, you'll just see bits and pieces of it. So yeah. All right, moving right along. This is the last item. This one is from Palen. Uh, like I said, I did buy this one, um, but it's not like any other ones that I have ever purchased. So I don't know if you can guess what it is. 
All right, so here we go. It is not a handbag. This one is Polen with Moje. I think that's how you say it. And it is a, let me just tell you more about this. This is a special collaboration that Polen had with uh, artists around the world. They have chosen this brand called, spelled M-O-B-J-E. It is a Japanese brand and they are known for making um, weaving. So Polen has a lot of uh, leather, remain remaining straps pieces that this uh designer decided to create something special with so you might have already seen them display this on their instagram or their email list but i had to get myself one so um i am very excited i think they'll continue to do more collabs in the future with other artists with their uh pieces uh the leather pieces so that they don't go to waste so i'm excited to see what they'll do but in the meantime this is what i purchased Very well wrapped, that's for sure. Okay. When I saw it, I was like, I kind of have one I want. I kind of have to have it. All right, so here we go. It doesn't look like much right now, but it is actually a vase. So let me just take some of the stuffing out. So there's a piece, a metal piece right here that holds it in place and um but you can open it so when you open it it looks like this uh, but you can also close it with this clipping and when you clip it shut you can change the shape of what this looks like so um let me just bring it closer to you this is a vase it's unlike any vase you've seen huh but uh it is designed with the moge uh brand the artist and the leather piece that you see down here this is from Polen so you can see that the logo at the bottom says Polen uh, Moje and uh, this is all weaved so it's a small piece of leather that they weave around and around to create this shape and then they bind it with this uh, this kind of fabric material and then they continue to weave this up until the very top where again there is a leather piece from Polen so uh, the little clip does say Polen and Moje. I don't think you'll be able to see it, but it's because it's very lightly um, engraved in there. But like I said, you can move it and then it becomes like a big open area. And then on the very middle right here um, is this really nicely wrapped piece. Um, this is a little glass container and um, Oh, is there something else in here? No, I don't think so. Yeah, so there, there is a bottom. So there's a bottom that like makes it so that it's almost like a beanbag bottom. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see that, but um, it, it basically it weighed this down. And so right now, this is very squishy now, you see? But if I put this back in here and it slots right in there, it's kind of the vase. Now you can see the glass face and then now you can't push it in. So you can put your flowers in here and make it look really nice. Um, I do plan, to, I know this is like, there's a lot going on here now, but so for example, I have this right here. This is a little hydrangea. I gotta cut it shorter, but you'll see that it has the effect. Like if I had more um, flowers, uh, it'll, it'll become a really nice face. And if I clipped it right here, I can do like, I can design it differently and you know, all that I can make it look like this, you know, I have to play around with it. I know it doesn't look like much right now, but I think it's so cool. All um, right, so guys. So that is all I have for you today. I hope you enjoy the video. If you're interested in the Polen vase, it does come in larger size. That's the smallest one. It does have a bigger size, taller size. And if you're interested in the Dior candles that I unboxed earlier, I will link that below as well. Again, it is limited edition. So if you're interested, jump on those. I don't believe they have those scents either. So I'll try to write below what the scents are. But yeah, they're, they smell beautiful to me, but to each their own. And and uh, finally, if you are interested in this Lola Rose watch, I, get, I do have a promo code. Yeah, I'm very impressed with the packaging, with everything so far. If you do pick something up, I would love to hear what you got because it was really hard to find, you know, it was really hard for me to pick out one because they all look really cool. They look very unique. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.